This is a horizontal candle that can burn for a really long time. And this is me burning it in minutes and almost burning my house down. Dear diary, I wanted a candle that reminded me of the 19th century. So I searched Amazon and then came across this. Yes, this is the candle I needed. So I bought it. The candle has a beautiful honey smell. Mmm, what a wonderful aroma. The packaging is fairly simple. Easy to take out and it's ready to go. I opened the box and slid it smoothly off the candle. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. It comes put together already, making it easy to get started. It comes wrapped in plastic. So I use my trusty knife to slice it open and remove it, like opening a present. How fun. Wow, I could really smell the honey aroma now. Mmm. Ah, the instructions. These will come in handy. Just kidding. Who uses instructions? Not me. All you need to do is set the clamp that holds the candle and wick upright. That was easy to do. Once it's set, you're ready for the next steps. So much fun, so much fun. But there was a problem. The beeswax is very stiff. It's not easy to handle. It is very difficult trying to unwrap the wax and place it in an upright position. I had to take the candle wax out of the holder and really work to get it straightened. This is going to be tedious each time I need to add more. But I think it might soften when it heats up. That should make it easier to handle. You want it to stick up about two inches. Yup, that seems about right. Now how do we light this thing? I found my torch and I was ready to go. Let's light this sucker. Once lit, I sat back and relaxed in my chair, enjoying the pleasing aroma of honey. But it began to grow bored and began to daydream. I enjoy daydreaming, pondering about my life's events, thinking about what I enjoy most, like the theater. The candle stayed lit for about 40 minutes. That's wonderful, but this is so boring. Diary, let's make this interesting. This candle could last days and light a single room perfectly. But what if I needed more light, even heat? So I had an idea. I slit the candle down the middle using a knife. I took my torch and began to soften the beeswax candle. Then I started to light the wick across the candle loop. <laughs> How interesting. This is going to be fun. The candle was lit multiple times and began to glow brightly. This could light an entire house. Why didn't I think of this? It began to get really hot. This is about the time I began to worry. Am I going to burn down my house? Will this get too hot and burn through my log ceiling and then the roof? What should I do? So if you're like me, don't buy boring candles unless you want to have some fun with this one.